Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're diving into something super important for all of us, mobility. Yes, I'm talking about moving better, feeling better, and living a more pain-free life. Whether you're a busy professional, a stay-at-home parent, or a seasoned athlete, these 10 steps will help you create a personalized mobility routine that fits your lifestyle perfectly. So let's get started. Step one, assess your current mobility. First things first, you need to know where you stand. To do this, you can either work with a certified trainer or do a self-assessment at home. Grab a mirror and perform basic movements like squats, lunges, and arm raises. Notice any restrictions, imbalances, or discomfort? Those are your areas of opportunity. Pro tip, record yourself from different angles to get a better view. Save these recordings for comparison as you progress. Step two, identify and prioritize areas for improvement. Based on your assessment, pinpoint the areas that need the most work. Prioritize based on how often you use those parts of your body in daily life and the level of discomfort you feel. If something hurts acutely, seek help from a healthcare professional before moving forward. Pro tip, test your balance with a one leg stand to see if it's a potential area for improvement. Step three, set clear, actionable goals. Now, set two or three clear goals. What do you want to achieve with better mobility? Maybe you want to pick up your golf ball with ease or squat without discomfort. Setting specific goals relevant to your lifestyle will keep you motivated and help you track your progress. Step four, choose the right exercises. Pick eight to 12 exercises that cover a full range of motion and focus on your target areas. Think about movements in all directions, forward, backward, side to side, and rotational. For example, if you want to improve your squats for golfing, include hip mobility and knee stability exercises like lateral lunges and box squats. Pro tip, search online for exercises tailored to your needs, but make sure the sources are reputable. Step five, keep it short and sweet. You don't need hours each week to see results. A well-structured plan can fit into less than an hour weekly. Try a 10 minute routine three times a week or a five minute routine five times a week. You can even squeeze in one or two minute sessions daily. Pro tip, use your mobility routine as a warm up before other workouts. Step six, integrate mobility into daily life. Make your mobility exercises part of your daily habits. Use habit stacking. Pair your new exercises with routines you already do, like brushing your teeth or watching TV. Pro tip, stretch while watching your favorite shows. Step seven, be consistent. Consistency is key. Set reminders on your phone and stick to your schedule. If you miss a day, don't stress. Just get back on track the next day. Pro tip, find a workout buddy for extra accountability. Step eight, track your progress. Keep a digital diary or notebook to track your progress. Note changes in range of motion, imbalances, and how you feel overall. Reassess every six to eight weeks and compare it to your original recordings. Step nine, adjust as needed. Your needs will evolve, so adjust your routine accordingly. If you hit a plateau, tweak your exercises or consult a professional for advice. Update your goals as you achieve them. Step 10, celebrate your wins. Celebrate your progress no matter how small. Improved range of motion or simply sticking to your routine is a big win. Pro tip, reward yourself with small treats or new gear to stay motivated. By following these 10 steps, you can create a personalized mobility routine that enhances your daily life and keeps you moving pain-free. Your body will thank you for it. Thanks for watching everyone. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe for more health and fitness tips. See you in the next video.